evening, everyone, and welcome to our Kids for Peace Love-a-thon. We are absolutely delighted to join together with you to share love, to spread love, and to blanket swaddle and wrap this world up with love. Um, in this next hour, you will get to listen to great music, hear inspiring words, make love links to help set a Guinness World Record, and help us raise funds to carry on our important work. So speaking of fundraising, um, we have a board member that wanted to be here to talk with us um, from Hawaii. His name is Dennis Ibarta. Um, he couldn't quite make it, he just texted me. So he asked me to make an announcement on his behalf. Um, on behalf of the Ibarta family, I'm thrilled to announce that he is making a $7,500 match donation tonight. He will match up to $7,500 anything that comes in for Kids for Peace. So we're so thankful to the Agartha family for that generosity. And that basically means that whatever you donate and contribute tonight will be doubled. So how cool is that? We're going to learn more about fundraising as the time goes. But I want to get to it and introduce our amazing, young, very talented MCs who are gonna take over and they're gonna run the rest of the night. And with us, we have Jasmine Papazian and James Jansen. And Jasmine, take it away. Hi everyone. I am so happy to be here with you all tonight. There is no doubt about it. Our world can definitely use a big dose of love, hope and unity. That's why I'm so excited to be here with you all. And I'm excited that we'll be working together to create a symbol of unity with our Linked by Love paper chain. Hi everyone, I'm also really happy to be here. And I'm stoked that we will be setting a Guinness World Record by making the longest paper chain with messages of love and hope. The love links that we will make tonight will be added to the final paper chain and this will help us set the world record. We need 100 miles of paper chain to do that. And I know we can do it. 100 miles, that's amazing. And I know we can do it too. Us kids are very powerful, and whatever we put our minds to, we succeed. Our five-year-old friend, Nina, who happens to be Asha's daughter, will show us how to make love links. Check this out. Hi, I'm Nina. I'm five years old, and I'm going to teach you how to create love links. Step one, gather your recycled paper. We want to take care of our Mother Earth. Step two, measure and cut length. Step three, decorate your wings with love and hope. They bring everybody together. What is your message with love and hope for the world? I've got to admit, that was super cute. Thanks, Nina, Nina, for showing us how to make love links. So now we invite all of you to make as many love links as possible. You can start tonight and continue to make them through the first week of January. The mail, then, after that, mail your flat links to Kids for Peace. And remember, the secret ingredient is love. So please put as much love as you possibly can into each one. That's nice, James. Like John and Paul said, all you need is love. We actually need 100 miles of love, but we can do it. I'm curious, how many, how many love links do all of you hope to make? It's always good to have a goal. Yes, a goal is good. That brings us to a chat box cheer question. Cheer! <laughs> That's fun. Every time you hear chat box cheer, please get ready to write a response in the chat box. We want to hear what you have to say. 
Here's our first chat box cheer question. What's your overall love link goal? How many love links will your family or household make and send to KFP? Pre please write your love link goal in the chat box. You guys are awesome. With your contributions, we will for sure reach our 100 mile goal. That will be a lot of love being spread. Someone who knows a lot about spreading love is our very own Shivani Ray. She's one of the very first Kids for Peace kids and is now a 20 year old speaker, singer songwriter, certified NLP practitioner, scuba diver, world traveler, and she's, on our, and she's our Kids for Peace spokesperson. Pretty impressive, right? All the way from Poland, here's Shivani Ray. Hello from Poland. My name is Shivani Ray, and I'm so beyond excited that I'm here sharing love and kindness with the world and with you all. Um, I was actually one of the first kids of Kids for Peace, and I'm thrilled that I'm still part of this amazing community of people. The song that I'm about to share with you all is called Spreading Love, and it was inspired by my travels throughout India and Asia, where we got to see some of the poorest parts of the world. And to see the kindness and love that are in those types of environments show what's possible for the rest of the world and how we can all embody more love and kindness. And I'm so beyond thrilled that back in 2015, we got to actually make this music video along with Nemo Patel, who is an amazing musician and artist, um, you know, teaching about love and kindness as well throughout all of his music. So. I hope that you watch this video and feel some more love and kindness in your life, and hopefully it inspires you to share more love and kindness with the world. Don't you feel the love is all around In the sky and in the ground In every single living thing In the song that I'm singing There are children in the streets That have not a thing to eat Yet their hearts are full of love They are beings from above Love's everywhere you go All you have to do is open up your soul the love inside you grow and take every chance you get to spread the love everywhere can you feel it in the air it's spreading everywhere can you feel the love inside it's spreading worldwide with every step you take there's pleasure there is We gonna take this magical feeling, spread it around from when the sun rises till the evening. Til the evening. Let it touch the heart of the soul that are grieving. Cause we rising and without you we ain't leaving. leaving. Love is a really special thing, can't be replaced with anything. Including diamond rings and rich wealthy kings. The offspring of a butterfly feels the love once it flies. Doesn't matter what your size, you'll feel the love inside. Now there's a thing called hate, and that's a classified mistake. There's only room for love today, so forget all the pain. Can you feel the love inside? It is spreading worldwide with every step you take. There is pleasure. Spreading love one at a time, one at a time. Doesn't matter your race, color or size. Color or size. All I know is that when I look into your eyes, love is all I wanna spread. I realize I love you. I say that truly from my heart. Cause I know if I don't start now, who knows when we'll depart. 
I have faith that our love creates a spark that starts a flame that will erase all the dark yeah imagine that dark turn into light just cause one of our hearts loosened up from its tight grip so it touched the next with all its joy and brightness and that's the story of how we ended this crisis can you feel the love inside the love, yeah. it is spreading the love, yeah. worldwide with every step you take there's pleasure there is pain every being everywhere That was amazing. And tonight is about leading with love, spreading love, and encouraging the whole wide world to embrace love. As we treat others with kindness, compassion, decency, and respect, the world is changed and love prevails. At Kids for Peace, we've let love lead the way from day one. In these past 14 plus years, we've been uplifting our world with love and action. We believe in it so much that we even made our tagline, Kids for Peace, uplifting the world through love and action. It's super cool that the family that came up with this ta that tagline is here with us tonight. Thank you, Pinto family, Donna, Glenn, Skylar, and Cody. Hi, everyone. Glad to be here and representing the Pinto family. And uh, it was a lot of fun putting that uh, tagline together many years ago and so happy that we're uplifting our world with love and kindness still. Thanks. Thanks for this wonderful event. That's awesome. And it's also very cool that four talented filmmakers from Carlsbad High School Television have edited all of our videos tonight. Let's give a big shout out to Caden, Colin, Luke, and Zach. Hello. Um, thank you guys. It was a pleasure working with Kids for Peace. Um, I had a lot of fun putting together the videos. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the creative editing that went into this. Thanks, guys. You are so talented and generous to volunteer your time to Kids for Peace. Yes, thank you guys so much. Let's check out the top 10 ways Kids for Peace has been putting our love into action. Love has the power to change the world. When we combine love with action, peace becomes possible. That's so true. With Kids for Peace and with love leading the way, we are creating a better world. Check it out. Here are 10 ways we've put our love into action. We really put our love into action through our Kind Coins campaign. Every year through the Great Kindness Challenge, we mobilize thousands of kids to help a wish come true for our true friend, Amy. We made a Dua's wish come true by building a school in Pakistan. Solomon got his wish granted as we built a public health clinic in Liberia. We built playgrounds in Puerto Rico, Texas, and Florida, which made Jetstream Jacks very happy. And we made Maggie's wish for a new school in her Kenyan village come true. That's me at the school. I traveled to Kenya and helped wire the school for its first ever electricity. We literally brought love and joy into the school. We have been spreading lots of love through Peach Pros, a new program designed through Lucy's Kids for Peace, a chapter I belong to in Shawnee, Kansas. This empowers teens to create self-directed service projects. I personally have done a cars for kids drive and made activity packets for kids in hospitals. And I also raised money to make sack lunches for St. Mary's Food Kitchen during quarantine. The Great Kindness Challenge is so special. Over 15 million kids in 115 countries are part of the goodness. 
We share love with our classmates, our teachers, our principals, our custodians, and our whole community. We serve, we smile, we help, and we hug. There's a lot of love happening during the Great Kindness Challenge. During this pandemic, we realized we needed to help everyone stay peaceful and positive. So we thought of lots of ways to spread love. We created a happy heart hunt with over 100,000 homes sharing their love. We showed gratitude to the delivery drivers. We made new friends through our Peaceful Pen Pal projects. We wrote love and letters to half our seniors, and we even started Camp Kids for Peace, a virtual summer camp where we connected with other peace builders around the world. We did service projects and had lots of fun. We put our love into action by turning the ordinary into extraordinary. We love to dream big and then make it happen. We have set a Guinness World Record for the largest collage of kind-hearted handprints. We have inspired the first ever skydiving peace sign formation. We convinced our school principals to jump out of an airplane and off a bridge to kick off the Great Kindness Challenge. And we assembled our local community to form a giant heart on the beach, which was shown on Good Morning America. That's me and my brother at the tip of the heart. We definitely like to spread our love in fun and surprising ways. Speaking of fun and surprises, Kids for Peace bought a bus, decorated it, and then drove across country on our Kindness Matters bus tour. It was so awesome going from city to city doing all of these kind acts. It was also pretty cool when we drove to Times Square to be on Good Morning America for the fifth time. When we heard about the immigration crisis at our borders, we knew we had to help. We created You Are Love Back. We collected backpacks, filled them with needed supplies, wrote encouraging notes in English and Spanish, and then hand delivered them to children in Tijuana, Mexico. Seeing all the smiles made me very happy. We love our senior friends. Through the intergenerational Grand Friends Kindness Project, we get to experience the wisdom of our elders. They get to experience our youthful energy. And together, we've completed a lot of wonderful acts of kindness. Did you know Kids for Peace has published four books? We've written and illustrated Peace Through Our Eyes, a book of hope and inspiration, Wish Big, Children's Wishes for the World, Create the Change, the Kids' Guide to Transforming the World, and Kindness Matters, 50 Ways to Create a Kinder World. There's a whole lot of love on those pages. Our Peace Pledge was created by us kids for the whole world. We believe if everyone lived by the words of our Peace Pledge, we truly would have a world of peace. That's why we love to share it. We've taken our peace pledge on the road and have presented it on the House floor of Congress, at a rally in front of the Lincoln Memorial, at the United Nations, at the United States Institute of Peace, at the White House Decision Center, and at halftime shows at several pro sports games, including the Washington Wizards basketball, Sporting KC's soccer, New York Rangers hockey, and San Diego Gulls hockey. Most importantly, we put the words of the Peace Pledge into action, which truly makes our world a better place for all. We are Kids for Peace. We uplift the world through love and action. I don't know about you, but I thought that was pretty impressive. Wow. Kids can definitely change the world, especially when we have grown-ups supporting us. Speaking of supporting kids, our executive director wants to talk with you about what your support can do for Kids for Peace and for the world. Awesome. Thank you so much, Jasmine and James. So this is a fundraiser, um, fun being the operative word, and um, the raiser part's really important as well. Um, we are inviting everyone to support the work we do so that we can carry it on and multiply the impact that we're having. Um, we're inviting everyone to make pledges tonight, 
every dollar pledged um, is going to equal another link on our 100 miles of paper chain. So we invite you to sponsor lots of links um, and pledge lots of dollars um, to make those links happen. And so we can support our Great Kindness Challenge, so we can support our Peace Pledge program, and so we can support our newest program, which is called um, Kind, Creative, and Connected in the Age of COVID-19. So we welcome you to do that. Um, we actually now have a new Venmo account to make it super easy for you. If you have Venmo, you could just go to Venmo, look up Kids for Peace, and you'll see our logo there. Um, we also have on the website, you can donate, and there'll be a link in the chat box if you want to uh, do through the website. Or if you like the old-fashioned way of writing checks, which is really nice too, you can just send us a check. You can put your pledges, um, you can write your pledges, how much you want to pledge in the chat box and um, we'll help you make that all happen. So thank you so much. It truly, truly makes a difference. Money is energy, energy is love. So we want more love in this world. Thank you. That makes me think that it's time for some more chat box cheer. Woo! <laughs> if you're in the position to make a donation tonight or soon, please write in the chat box the amount you'll donate. Any amount from $1 to $100,000 will be greatly appreciated. That's so awesome. Keep the love going, people. So now I think it's time for some more music. Please welcome We The Commas, a talented brothers trio from Carlsbad, California, whose videos have over 1 million views each on YouTube. When you hear them, you'll know why. They're amazing. Hi, Lenny, Jordan, and Cam. Hey, hey, thank you. And we just want to say thank you so much to everyone for joining this movement. Where are we the commas? I'm Lenny. This is Jordan, and this is Cam. You can check us out on all platforms at We the Commas. We just want to try to spread love and positivity through our music. And that's why we chose to perform Custom Made. Custom Made's a song about loving the most authentic version of other people and also loving the most authentic version of yourself. Yeah, and that being said, we'd like to leave you guys with this last word of encouragement to never forget that love is a simple choice. Ah, nice. Thank you guys. Roll it. i 
That was great. I'm feeling the love. We have lots of other very special guests who are also feeling the love and want to share their message of love and hope with you all. Check this out. Hi, Kids for Peace. I just wanted to say thank you so much for everything that you're doing and inviting me to be a part of this because I too am a fellow child who wants peace. And I wanted to make my sign that says love makes a difference because especially in this time whenever all the hate and sadness and craziness is going on in the world, if you show someone a little bit of kindness and compassion, it could really make a difference in their day or in their week or in their month or year. You never know what other people are going through. So show some love and kindness because love makes a difference. Hi, Kids for Peace. Owen here. I'm so, so, so excited that I was asked to be a part of this organization that promotes love and happiness for everyone. The world needs our help like now more than ever before. And one way that we can do that is spreading as much love as we possibly can. Spread the word. Hi Kids for Peace. Thank you so much for doing everything that you're doing. I'm so excited to be part of the Levathon and I love seeing everyone just come together and spread love. And I just want to let you guys know that you are beautiful inside and out. Mm -hmm. Hi guys, I'm Christine Thompson, your National American Miss Alabama. As a title holder for one of the biggest organizations for young women across the country, it's so important that I practice inclusivity, equality, and kindness in everything I do every day. That's why I'm here to spread my message. Be the best you can. I know life gets hard. But if you start every day with a positive, optimistic outlook on life, doing your very best in treating others with kindness and putting in the best effort you can in everything you do, you'll find success and you're better for it. <laughs> Be the best you can. Hi Kids for Peace. Um, I just wanted to say thank you kids so much for everything that you guys are doing to make the world a better place. This world has never needed love like it needs right now. And that is why I'm happy to join this campaign to show that we can all come together and treat each other with dignity and respect. This is my wish for the world. The reason why this is what I chose to say is because I know that there's a lot of crazy things going on in the world right now, but if we all come together and we stay safe then everything will be okay hi kids for peace thank you so much for everything you've been doing for the world and i'm so happy to be part of this campaign and watching everybody come together and spread love and positivity hi kids for peace my name is reagan and thank you so much for all the hard work you're doing to make this world a better place this world has never needed love more than it does now and I am so grateful to be working with you guys to spread love and happiness. And my wish for the world is keep calm and love. Hi Kids for Peace, Seth Carr here. You are making this world a better place and I'm happy to be a part of this campaign. Here's my wish. Wow, it is so fun to see stars from, from some of my favorite movies talking about love and peace. I mean, wow. Black, Pan Black Panther, Gifted, Captain Marvel, Ghostbusters, and Daddy Some. Amazing. Yeah, and some of my favorite TV shows, Modern Family, Young Sheldon, and Fuller House, and The Thunderman's used to make me smile so much. 
it's so cool to have the support of so many people and it's so cool that so many young people are sharing their love. Yasmin, I think it's time for a check-in to see how we're doing for the fundraising. To get our updated tally, let's go to Asha, the amazing Kids for Peace program director and Colleen of Getting It Done. Miss Asha, what is our current tally? Hi, good evening, everyone. It's such a pleasure to be part of tonight's evening. I'm so happy to see almost nearly 200 families that join us to spread love and positivity. I can definitely see it through the chat. I have chills all over my body. So thank you for your generous contributions. And I'm excited to share that we have raised $3,473. So thank you to the Jansen family. Thank you to the Tucker family, Festo family, Clark's family. Thank you for every donation, every dollar count. So big heartfelt thank you goes to all of you. Thank you. Back to you. Wow, that's great. Let's keep it up. Have you pledged a donation yet? If not, it'd be super cool if you did. And it's so easy with Venmo. We are very thankful to you all for being with us tonight. We'd love to see some of your love links and wishes of love and hope that you're writing on them. It's time for some more chat box cheer. Woo! What is your wish for the world? Please write your wishes of love and hope in the chat box. We want to know what you're writing on your love links. It's so inspiring reading, reading these wishes in the chat box. This is what love looks like. And do you want to know what love sounds like? Listen to our next musical guest and you'll know exactly what love sounds like. I am so happy to introduce Allegra Miles, our very own Kids for Peace kid back when she was only four years old. And now she's a musical superstar who was on the semifinals of The Voice last season. Please welcome Allegra Miles. Hi guys, thank you so much for having me. Um, it's so great to be here. It's so full circle to, like she said, when I was four, uh, being in Kids for Peace, um, along with my sister, along with a lot of my friends when I was younger. Um, and it's incredible now to see everything um, that you guys have done and continue to do and continue to keep growing. Um, so the song uh, I have for you today, it's called I'll Believe in You. I wrote it a few years ago. Um, I wrote it for someone in my life who was going through a pretty hard time and I think it's important to remember we have to check in on our friends, on our loved ones, um, and let them know that you are there for them and, and uh, continue to spread that love and peace around the world. So hope you enjoy.
Wow, that was great. I feel the love. Now let's see some love from a few of our families. When I call your family's name, please say hi, show us your love links, and tell us what your wish for the world is. Let's start with the Heath family. Go ahead. Hi, my name is Wyatt, and I chose these two love links. Kindness is cool because, of course, kindness is, and then... All We Need Is Love, which is one of my favorite songs from one of my favorite bands, The Beatles. And my wishes for the world are that everybody is equal and everybody stays healthy during this COVID pandemic. Very nice. And then we'd also love to hear from the Sandor family. Hello, here we are. <laughs> Um, we have a few love links here. Um, we have one that says to save our oceans because we think that that is really important in the future of everybody. Go ahead, Dylan. We have uh, love for everybody and we should love all. This one is we love family. <laughs> I love this. <laughs> and then how about the Carlson family? Uh, the two love links that we chose were love has power and kindness matters because love holds a lot of power. It can change someone's day or maybe just their second, but it can change a lot. And kindness matters because kindness really does matter. And like love, it can shape a day or a world. That's and then we well, we also have some other ones that we don't have to read, but oh, wow. we definitely want to spread the love. So we have a lot of live, love, laugh, and just be happy and spread the world. Spread the word. Nice job. And then one more right now. Can we see the love links from the Sutherland family? Hi, we're the Sutherland family. Hi, I'm Doug. Bella. Kate. Uh, we are, our goal is to make 100 links today. 
are the ones we are showcasing are Kindness Matters and Choose Love. Uh, we're very excited to be here and spread kindness, spread love as much as we can in this world we live in today. Wow, that's amazing. That's a lot of love links. Well, all this love is making me so happy. The donations coming in are also making me happy because I know as we have funds to support our work, more kids get to experience the power of serving others and leading with love. Please keep those donations coming. Let's check again. Let's check in again with Asha to get the current tally. I know one thing that will help is this great big donation from the Peacemakers Fund for $7,000. Thank you so much to Andrew Munt and David Hucho for being believing in us kids. It truly makes a difference. So now let's go on. Let's go to Asha for the update. Hi again, families. This is all so exciting. Thank you for this outpouring of love and generosity that we see. Uh, so let's see, we have raised together over $3,673. So thank you, thank you. Um, this is amazing. Let's continue celebrating. And uh, back to you, Jasmine. That's amazing. And with the match from the Igarta family, we are doing really well. And all the love links we are making tonight will certainly uplift, uplift our world. I'd love to see more of the love links you all are making. When I call your name, will you please show us some of your love links and tell us what your message of love and hope is? Let's hear from the Clark family. Hi, from Hi. the Clarks. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Um, we um, have lots of messages. Mine is, mine is peace, peace rocks. Mine is um, spread love and positivity. Mine is your beautiful inside and out. Yeah, we love kids for peace. Kids for peace. Woo! Hi everyone. <laughs> Oh, that was so great to hear from you guys. All right, next up, the Chalky family. Hi from the Chalfies in Kansas. Um, thanks for letting us be a part of the Love-a-thon tonight. My wish for the world is to care for each other. Well, Get it up there a little closer. Uh, my name is Lily and mine says more kindness. My name is Grace and my wish is more animals. Hi, I'm Luke and I put um, you can do anything and believe in yourself. And I'm Michael and I said truth. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Um, Watana Tucker, will you show us your love links? Yes. Oh, so I did kind. Actually, I'm really going to have to up my game because I've made a lot of them already. Um, but you guys are really good. So I don't know. I might spend the rest of the night because I have my little trees. And I have the ocean, which I really love. And... Um, so, and then here's my wish for the world. Happy. If you can put a smile on your face, you can put a smile on somebody else's face. Thank you so much for making all of those incredible love links. And last but not least, the Fessler family. Hello. Hi, Hi everybody from Carlsbad. Wait, over here. Um, this is mine because I was inspired by the song, um, I'll Believe in You. It was a beautiful song, so thank you for singing it. Um, I was inspired to write, I don't know if you can see this, um, but it says, Hope, Love, and Peace with Little Hearts. Uh, and I said, the Spread Kindness, uh, the Kids for Peace motto. I'm wishing love to all, to everybody out there. 
Thank you. I love it. I can really feel the world smiling from all of these wishes. Same. All those wishes sure do make me smile. And I can't believe it, everyone, but our time together is almost up. But we have one more special surprise for you. Please welcome Giancarlo Esposito, four-time Emmy-nominated actor and all-time champion of all that is good in this world. Mr. Giancarlo will lead us in closing love -a -thon activity to help send all of our collective love out to the world. Welcome, Giancarlo Esposito. Thank you so much, Jasmine. Um, what great hosting um, you're doing tonight. I am uh, overwhelmed. Uh, I feel like I've been administered to with such a beautiful wish um, bubble and held so beautifully in love's hands. Uh, this is just such a great thing to be a part of. And I feel like um, I just want to go, I love you. I think to myself, what is love? And from the moment we started tonight, I hear it reflected back to me. In my own brain, I say love is action. Love is in the doing. Love is in self-care. Love is in reaching out. Love is without ego. Love is all encompassing. Love can change all of our lives and have us feel full as I feel full right now. I know that Kids for Peace is raising the bar. They're raising the bar because we're all human and all we need to do is remember. All I need to do is to tune into you guys uh, once a week to realize that I'm love in action. It's palpable. It's intention. If your intention is to be in love with life, in love with the world, and in service to others, and in service to yourself in terms of self-care, then it's easy to say, hey, family, I need your love today. Hey, I need a hug so I can give a hug. I need to be able to experience and be around people who fill me up. Well, I am completely filled up. I realize that love asks for nothing. Love exists in a place without fear. Love is attentive to emotions. It's attentive and sensitive to other people. It's attentive and sensitive to our oceans, our waters, our rivers, our streams, our air. When you start to feel full with love, you start to see and recognize things you never recognized before. How beautiful it is to step outside and take a deep breath and have that breath fill you up with clean air. How beautiful it is to see animals roaming in parks where they've roamed for not many years during this period of time in our world. We are love completely and fully through and through. And when we start to realize that, man, you kids are leading the way, man. I'm, I just want to, you know, you've made me feel like I matter tonight. You've made all of us who are watching feel like there is a route to the new world. And it's through our understanding that we're all together. This love-a-thon needs to continue. And I want to just reiterate that we would like you to give some cash because energetically in our world, Jill McManigal said it so beautifully, that's energy. And we want to put good energy into the world. And by all of you joining all of the families, including my own blended McEspo family, who I'm so very proud of, um, have guided me to a place where I realize love is what we got. And that's all we have. So, and it's a beautiful thing. It's a powerful thing. And I believe in you because you believe in me and you believe in the power of love. Let's just take a moment as we close before I turn it back over to all of you beautiful sponsors and beautiful facilitators and beautiful leaders in this route to a loving place that helps us to embrace ourselves. Sometimes I know for me, it's hard to ask for help. It's hard to say I'm lonely, I'm alone. Please think of me, please send me love. But when it comes to me, I realize, why are you so afraid to ask? So for me, I take my hands to my heart 
Some of you may want to close your eyes and take your hands and put them over your eyes so that you can envision and see the interior of your being, so that you can see the flow and the thread of love that comes from going inside and fostering and creating this love around you. Let's put our hands on our heart, put our hands on our head, put our hands where we feel like we need the most encouragement. And let's just pull from the field of energy that is love. Do you feel that field of energy? It doesn't only exist within our hearts because we've been sharing this love. It exists now in a field of energetic energy around us and around the world. And so let's just pull that love from that field as we with one hand extend our love to it and the other hand receive love from it. That field is for all of us. It exists for all of humanity. All we need to do is feel it, breathe it in, recognize it, and allow it to wash over us. Because as strange as it may seem in this world that exists in certain conflict and non-conflict, that when you choose the road of, road of love, that there is no other path that you can take. So for me, I ask the universe to embrace each and every one of us, all human beings, those who are in this stratus field and in this field of love that can connect to it and those who still haven't found that connection and that root. It's there for you, it's there for all of us. And through the ignition, the igniting of this passion, through the igniting of this sharing, through the smile, the tears that come to my eyes, when I feel and see love in action, because that's what love is. Love is action. So I actively send you all love. I actively send the universe love. And I actively ask for it to be rebounded like a mirror back to all of those precious souls who need and want and desire to be on this train, but just don't know how to get there. I thank you, and I'm in such deep gratitude for the sharing and the blessing I've received tonight. I've been asked to speak, but why, why me? Well, why me? Because I needed to hear all of you. I needed to hear these lovely songs. I needed to be blessed by energy and surrounded by energy that's loving. I needed to be able to be reminded that I am a ball and an infusion of love that can affect other people's lives as each and every one of you are. See, the feeling that you have when you're in service is a feeling like no other. I walked out of a place, I said, I gotta get a quick meal tonight because I don't wanna be hungry. I don't wanna be thinking about anything but this loving energy this evening. And I walked out of a little takeout joint and a man looked at me and he said, nice hat. And I looked at him and I've heard that many, many times because I love my hats. They're kind of cool, I guess. But I stopped and I said, did you hear that, Giancarlo? Did you hear that? Love. He said some words, nice hat. But underneath it, the all-encompassing vibration was, I love your hat. And I looked at him and smiled and said, thank you. I walked five steps and there was a man standing in the doorway who looked at, the, looked at me and said, money, money for food. And I looked at him and I couldn't move. I put my hand in my pocket and took out a few dollars and I gave it to him. And I thought to myself, our lives are a test of who, a test and testament of who we are, how willing we are to share, how willing we are to give, how willing we are to give and receive love. When we get to that moment in time that the universe is embraced by all of our love, everything will change. And we're on our way due to all of you at Kids for, Sp Kids for Peace. I love you. I love you, I love you. Thank you. That, that was amazing. Thank you so much, Giancarlo. And thank you, musical performers. Thank you, celebrity guests. Thank you, Kids for Peace Board members. Thank you, CHSTV volunteers. And most importantly, thanks to you for being with us tonight and helping bring more love to our world. I second that. Thanks so much to all of you. This has been a lot of fun.
And now to close it out, let's go back to our co-founder and executive director, Jill McManigal. Thank you. Well, I am um, overtaken by the goodness that this night is. Um, I'm overtaken by the love that I know this world needs and we're bringing it. Um, I'm thankful to you all. This is an extra extraordinary time, extra, extra extraordinary time. Um, and it's our love that is going to keep us on that path of goodness. So I thank you so much. We're going to close out doing what we do at all of our Kids for Peace meetings. And we close out with a cheer that goes, let there be peace, yeah. And we take all of our wishes for peace out into the world. And we always do it um, like cheerleader style, huddle style, where we put our hands in the middle. Right? So let's all put our hands in. Let's pretend that we are on top of each other with our hands and our love. And on the count of three, all together, we can unmute if you have a mute button. We'll all unmute. And on the count of three, we will say, let there be peace. And then, yeah, we'll take all of our wishes of love out to the world. Let there be peace. Yeah, on the count of three. One, two, three. Let, let there be peace. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Love you, Dylan. You. Bye. Bye. Good job, kids, for peace. Love you. Bye. I wanted to. We love you guys. Love you. Hush, little darling, don't you cry. Every little thing's gonna be alright. Don't worry, don't be afraid.